I think that's cute enough. You wanted to touch some grass. Get yeah, ready for the grass. Grass! Let's do this. Oh, isn't that I kind of hate it? In a few days, we're gonna hit my three year anniversary of being self employed, and it's such a big milestone for me. Like, I literally feel like I've just been going and going and going for three years straight, and it's like finally hitting. I'm thinking about updating my profile picture and my banners and everything. I have a few things to do before we can start doing all of that though. Okay, we are back from doing chores and errands and stuff. I feel like to continue this video, we need to insert a montage of my favorite moments of the past three years, but like in a very cheesy way. I'm trying to meet more people, so I'm not bored here. I finally got my Nevada license. So today is my birthday. First birthday that I've celebrated away from home. Just hit 4K followers. My hard drive died. Hello, I am back from work. I'm a big boy now. Today I quit my job. I just launched my Patreon. Oh my god, did you see that chain? New room? Just went in and had it all like I have an office now. But this was the first sample I ever made. But these. There's salad under here. There's veggies. This morning I got on a call with Adobe and it was to prepare for my live stream. Um, I did a live stream with them one and a half years ago, but it was fun. So I'm excited to go on again. I'm back. I knocked out for like an hour or two after eating my salad. And then now I'm hyper fixated on these really beautiful stained glass lamps. And I made a whole Pinterest board of them. So this is my Pinterest board tour. These are all the lamps that I'm obsessed with. So May is coming up and for Patreon, I decided to do a very special little reward. So I actually designed a sticker sheet, which is gonna look like this and I'm super excited about it. And I also designed a postcard that looks like this and I'm so in love with it. Like I tried very hard to experiment with the color palette and to make it kind of uh, different from what I'm used to. I wanted to do like one saturated color and then I wanted it to have like more pastels for everything else. But yeah, I'm just making the preview picture right now so that I can post it on my feed and on Patreon. Yeah, usually I design my previews in Procreate. The trail is so full of twists and turns. You tell me to slow down, but I just don't seem to learn. The earth shifts beneath our feet, it seems. So I'm glad to be on your team. Required, no rule book desired. It's us against, against the 
against the world in pink The ref can call offside the whole day through This team is me and you I think this is it. I've been thinking about my mom a lot recently. One, because it's almost Mother's Day, but two, for the past three years of building my business, I feel like we've grown our relationship together so much, and I'm really appreciating her patience through the entire process. Things haven't always been easy, but the older I get, the more I feel like I need to show my mom love in both the big and small ways. Stuff like putting aside time to chat with her about little wins in life, like what she ate for dinner, or this one's one of my favorites, but she'll ask me, which means, what is the gossip lately? Also, sending her little gifts or treating my parents to a meal when there's something to celebrate. This Mother's Day, I wanted to send her a pair of Ana Luisa jewelry and I know already that she's gonna say, why did you send me such a nice present? Because she's not used to opening gifts or accepting nice things for herself from other people and to that I say, that's even more of a reason why you should treat yourself and your loved ones to something nice. Ana Luisa offers long-lasting tarnish resistant jewelry that makes you feel good wearing it. I've been wearing their jewelry for almost a year on a daily basis and as someone that is a bit lazy with removing all my jewelry at night, I really appreciate how comfortable they are. I literally just go to sleep, I shower with them on, and sometimes this is for weeks on end and they still look just as good as when I first got them. What I love most is that their designs are affordable starting at $39 and they are backed by a two-year warranty. Right now, they're having a Mother's Day sale till May 10th with a buy one get one 60% off deal or you can use my code applecheeks20 for 20% off. Thank you Ana Luisa for sponsoring this video and remember to show your loved ones that you care and this can come in any way, shape or form. Shoot them a text, buy them some flowers, maybe get them some Ana Luisa jewelry. We're going hiking today at Mount Charleston. We wanted to touch some grass. We're going to do this before it gets too hot. Let's go! I don't know what a warm up is. This we'll is touch humbling. the toes. Oh, yeah! A little toe touch? Touch some toes. Oh, we're this about is to nice. touch some grass. Get ready for the grass. Yeah, oh, we got the. Okay. Yoga. Oh. Uh, warrior. Warrior one. That actually feels really good. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't stretched in a long time. Warrior two. He's right. <laughs> oh, okay. Good. Warrior two. Warrior two. Warrior two. Warrior two. Warrior two. Warrior two. Warrior We're nature people now. We're nature people. No, we're not. Nature people fart, right? Not allowed. Excuse me. Oh, I'm channeling my inner Wes Anderson. <laughs>
Hello, hello. I just got back home. I feel like such a grown up. I've been running a lot of errands recently. I went to the dentist. There's still some of that uh, polisher in my teeth, so it's kind of crunchy in there. Um, I'm thinking about doing some drawing today because I was watching Lee's video and it just made me really want to draw. And it's very windy outside, so I apologize on behalf of the wind for being glorious. I'm actually working on what I'm planning on designing on the Adobe Live tomorrow. I procrastinated it a little bit too long. I was thinking about doing like a persimmon plush. I'm not sure if I'm ever gonna manufacture this by the way. This is clearly like, I'm making this just for the Adobe Live, but if I really love the design, maybe in the future I can manufacture it, but yeah, I'm just doing a bunch of like persimmon drawings and just like getting into the mood. This page is super ugly. It's pretty much my warm-up page, but I'm really digging how lumpy this guy looks. So I'm gonna base it off of him. Like he looks like what I want to be right now. A lumpy beanbag plush. So my name is Tiffany and I'm also known as Apple Cheeks. This is usually like how I would approach manufacturing things. And what I also like to do in the file is to put out what kind of materials I would like. Oh my god, I am still recording. <sighs> that was actually really fun. 
I feel like I was super nervous at first, but I think it went really well. I'm gonna decompress now because that was like an hour and a half. This is kind of what I was doing. This little persimmon dude. Maybe I might actually, I mean, I'm almost done designing it. So maybe one day I will manufacture it and make him a plushie. I'm terrified right now. So I designed a new profile picture, but this one using my face, it's no longer the little doodle of the girl that I've had for the past like three or four years. And this feels like such a big commitment and I'm so terrified, but yeah. I'm gonna change my profile picture, finally. So this is my first ever profile picture that I designed and this was the one that I had before I'm changing it to the one that I just showed you. So uh, I decided to continue with the bluish green, even though it's like not my, honestly, it's not my most favorite color anymore. This used to be my favorite color when I first started Apple Cheeks, but I feel like it would be like a good consistency to transition people into getting used to the new profile picture. Goodbye, old icon. Let's do this. Let's do this together. What if I hate it? Okay, wait, let me see. Uh, mm, uh, mm, mm. Is it that I kind of hate it? I don't know. I'm gonna let this marinate for a little bit. A few hours later. After playing with my profile picture for the past hour or so, I finally landed on one that I'm actually pretty happy about. But I went through a lot of variations. So we started out here, right? And just kept going and going and going and going and going and going and going. And this is the one that I chose. And I feel like this one, it's the best that it's gonna get. It didn't look colorful enough and it looked very just like monochromatic as my friend told me, which I agreed with. So adding the color in the little squiggles, I think worked out really well. I'm a new woman. I also want to figure out like what banners to change everything to because my banner is really outdated. Go, go. Yes. Girl Scouts. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Oh fuck! I rolled my ankle. I saw that. 